April marks the last time someone reported seeing Martin Roberts. So this year, his family decided they wanted to focus on hope. What better symbol than the butterfly? I don't think anybody saw anything like this coming. John Roberts scans his memory for a sign of what could have led to his then 19-year-old son Martin's disappearance. He remembers their last phone call. We have conversations during the week. Uh, we were making plans for next semester. Um, as far as Martin's apartment and classes and schedules and things like that. Martin was last seen on April 21, 2016. Days went by and his family hadn't heard from him. His roommates got into his room. No sign of Martin. Instead, all of his electronic devices left behind with a cryptic note. Basically saying that he was leaving and, um, you know, just going out or going forward. Martin was last seen by his cousin around lunchtime near Apps Convocation Center. Since then, a roller coaster of emotions. Martin's dad says tips and leads ending so far in disappointment, but not in defeat. The Boone Police Department told us you have hope till you have a reason not to have hope. And, you know, quite frankly, we haven't found any definitive answers. So as far as we know, he's still live and kicking somewhere. And this year, his family decided to give hope flight. Butterfly uh, is a symbol of hope and of new beginnings. If you're looking for a sign of hope, look no further than the North Carolina Zoo's Kaleidoscope Butterfly Garden. To take it somewhere where we're having more of a, a positive impact in areas that would uh, mean something to him. This year, the Roberts sponsored the Monarchs in honor of Martin to keep his name and hope alive for all who pass through. To us, he was extraordinary, and uh, we really look forward to seeing him again soon. While the family wants you to marvel at the beauty of the monarchs and the other butterflies, more than anything, they just want to see their son again. If you have any information on Martin Roberts, you're asked to call the Boone police immediately. Reporting in Asheboro, Meredith Stutz, WXII, 12 News.